Welcome to another Test Your Tennis IQ. The question today is, when you're hitting a standard volley, okay, a volley, any ball that you hit before it bounces, you take it on the fly. Standard volley, the swing length would be A, 5 to 10 feet, B, 10 to 15 feet, or C, three to four feet. Okay, standard volley, what would you say? The answer is C, three to four feet. When you're hitting a standard volley, you're usually, you know, fairly close to the net and the ball is coming pretty fast. You don't have time to take a big swing at the ball. Okay, so you're gonna make it short and simple. Basically, you're just trying to get the racket set, turn, so from my ready position, okay, remember, in the ready position, the racket, you want those elbows out in front. And when you turn, you're just turning to here. That's it, from there to there is maybe a foot and a half, okay? And then you're just going to step in and swing, you know, another foot and a half, that's the whole swing, three feet. So that's the key on the volley. Keep it short. I like to tell my students, just make a target for the oncoming ball, okay? Turn, turn the shoulders, make the target. Then step in with a simple high to low swing with a racket face slightly open. Now, if you were going to hit a swing volley, that's a different story, okay? A swing volley might be a volley that you take, well, you could take it anywhere on the court, but usually swing volleys are, you know, mid-court area around the service line, or even deeper, or it could be closer. <laughs> it could be anywhere. But a swing volley, you're taking, it's basically the same as your ground stroke, okay? You're just taking a full cut, you know, you're you're turning all the way, you're getting the racket back, and it's, you're swinging all the way, taking the ball before the bounce. That's the swing volley. Then you would need, you know, a longer swing, maybe 15 feet long at least, okay? Because, you know, from, from the ready position, you're bringing your racket back six or seven feet, you're dropping it down, you're swinging up and around. So, you know, there you've got the 15-foot swing. But on a standard volley, when you're close to the net, the ball's coming really fast, boom. Right there, foot and a half back, foot and a half forward, that's it. So three, four feet maximum. You don't want a big swing. Okay, let's take a look in slow motion. Turning the shoulders, I've set the racket. I've made the target for the ball. My left foot is ready to step in. Now I'm swinging down on this shot, but notice the racket face is open. That's going to give me net clearance. And right there, I am finished the swing. The swing is over. I'm just gonna bring the racket back to the ready position from there. Okay, again, turning the shoulders and making the target with my racket for the oncoming ball. Left foot is ready to step in. Now, notice how short this swing is. Right there, I'm swinging high to low. The racket face is open. Right there, I am finished with the swing. The swing is over. It's a three-foot swing, maybe four-foot maximum. Okay, last one. This ball was extremely low, so I had to really open the face. Made the target, I came under it, opened the face, and I got my net clearance. Well, I hope you enjoyed that video. Please give it a like, a thumbs up, and please subscribe to the channel and share it with your friends. All the best, and to your tennis success. Take care.